Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. If you're looking for a job, you can log on to interview.com and you can post your resume with us. In this video, I'm going to talk about five basic Java interview questions. What is the use of transient keyword? Keyword in transient keyword in Java is used to indicate that a field should not be serialized. So for example, you have a class called employee and you have a department ID and employee name, employee number. In that deployment uh, department ID, you want you, you want to skip that serialization process. You don't want to store that in the flat file or database. So in order to skip the serialization process for department ID, you can mark that variable as transient. So transient keyword in Java is used to indicate that a field department ID should not be serialized. For example, department ID I'm giving. So in order to skip that serialization process, you can mark that particular attribute as as transient what are the static methods static methods are also called as class methods can only operate on static variables please remember static means at the class level they are attached to the class and not at the object level if you see if you uh, check in your programs you can actually uh, using objects also you can access the uh, static methods but though you can access but they are attached to the class and not to object at all if you look at the decompiled code you can check the object should have been replaced by the class name itself so decompiler the compiler does that actually what is a final variable a variable constant value variable value can't be changed can't be changed after instantiation so if you want to if you want a variable in your application where once initialized you want to maintain it as a, as a constant then you can mark that variable as final what is the final method final method can't be overridden in the subclass so you have a display method in the base class and if you the moment you mark it as final no subclass can override that method they can't give any implementation code in this subclass what is final class Final class can't be subclass or no other class can extend it. So for example, you have a class final employee and for the employee you mark that class as final and in the subclass you are trying to extend from this class. That is not possible at all because you have marked the class as final. That means you are saying nobody can extend it, nobody can inherit it, inherit the methods. So in Java, string class is the final because they don't want anyone to extend the string class and provide their own implementation. Hope these questions are useful for your Java entry preparation. Thank you and all the best.